Hi friends, in this session I want to show you how to quickly gather the schema and review the schema of a tab table. Uh, so just type the name of the table uh, and, and select it and then write uh, press Alt plus F1. F F1. So this will uh, populate the schema of the table for you and all the constraints every, all the I mean the complete detail for for the schema of a table and now this is because uh, it is having the DBO schema now what if there is a predefined schema how would you do that I mean consider uh, a human resource employee uh, table a table belonging to the schema human resource how would you get it I mean if you select this and then press control plus F1 it would give you an error right so what you have to do is put a quotes against it and then select it and press alt plus F1 the same thing you would press alt plus F1 and this uh, would give you the schema of the table uh, so that is how do you uh, actually uh, get the schema in, in such a quick way uh, the reason lies behind the option called shortcuts uh, so if you see if you go to the keyboard and you see alt plus f1 there is a stored procedure against it uh, by default which is sp underscore help so sp underscore help gives you the uh, the same things i mean if you s say it would give you the schema it is because of this reason that you are able to uh, able to see a uh, view the schema now uh, what if I would uh, want to see uh, the procedure definition? So to do so, the command is sp underscore help text. So I uh, write it for control. I write it against control F1 and say save it. And now let's pull out a stored procedure. And then try control plus F1. Uh, I think we would have to open a new session because we have made a change. So, uh, yeah, so open another session because from here on, I think we would be we would be able to able to uh, see the change now. If we pull out the same stored procedure, so and say control plus F one, what we get is the definition of, of uh, the stored procedure. And this this would apply not only for the stored procedure, but we could uh, get it for uh, functions as well. So if we if we just say uh, we have a function msg. So if we press Control plus F1 again, we would see the definition. So so that's the command that you have to write. So I have I have been able to show you how to see the definition of a table, the schema of the table. Uh, in both the cases when we when it has a defined schema and the default schema and also what change you need to make to uh, get the uh, the complete definition uh, of a stored procedure function uh, or, or even a trigger for, for that matter with the help of sp underscore help text addition thank you friends